All right, here we go, Matt Barnes. Welcome back. Yeah, part two, man. Huh? Part two. Oh, uh, man, it's been, it's been, been like three years. Has it? Man, the whole world has changed. Yeah, the man. whole world has changed not, since not, our last interview. Not for the better. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely a few, <laughs> a lot of speed bumps along yeah. the way. Well, we can't start the interview without talking about what's happening right now in Boston. <sighs> so it was announced today that uh, I made Udoka has been suspended for an entire year. Mm. Now, you spoke about it on Instagram. Yeah, last night. Last night. What is your overall take about what's happening? Uh, my overall take was I spoke too soon but without knowing the facts. Mm. Um, you know, I thought, you know, my point of view was if this was a basic uh, situation where, you know, he had slept with someone in the organization, I thought it was a little harsh. You know what I mean? I thought, like, this is very common, not only in the NBA, but across all corporate businesses. And I thought a year for a suspension was a lot. But then after I made my post, someone literally called me right after, maybe two minutes later, and told me what happened. So I had to backpedal, man. Like I took down my post and today I came up and, and kind of just let people know, like I, I misspoke, you know, in the media, I think too often people misspeak or, or, or say the wrong shit, but never apologize when they're wrong. And I just don't move like that. So after I found out what happened, I had to back up and, and, and assess the situation. And, you know, I'm not going to say what happened. If it comes out, it'll probably come out because it's, uh, you know, everything eventually comes out, but I just can't support, you know, some of the stuff he did. So that's why I kind of had to backpedal off that and, 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 you know, let people know I was wrong for jumping out there without the information. Well, yeah, I know a few things about the situation and without getting into any details, it's not so much that he slept with someone, but who he slept with. That's, that's potentially going to come out and so no, forth. Yeah, that, that's what I'm gonna, hearing too. So uh, yeah, like yeah. I said, if, if what I heard is true, it's just like, yo, you on your own, bro. I came back that. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. And as someone who's owned a business now for, I mean, what, 20 years now, Vlad TV, 15 years, I've never understood the whole sleeping with coworker thing. It just, in a world full of women and men and, right. you know, billions of people, why mess around in a dangerous environment yeah. like the place where you work? It's the whole shitting where you eat yeah. situation, literally. Like yeah. why? Why even do that? I've, it's never even come in my head to do something like that because I'm like it's just too dangerous on so many different levels. Yeah, yeah just the po the power dynamic. You know, what I mean, to each his own. No one's claiming to be perfect. I'm far from perfect, but you know, just the whole shit and where you eat is is a tough situation. You know what I mean? So that's something that I've always tried to stay clear of uh, because now it's you know this is life after basketball and they're waiting for you to slip like that. You know what I mean? So I'm come on, man. I'm good. <laughs> 